Hey guys, welcome to Back to Our Roots Homestead. Hope everyone's week is off to an amazing blessed start. This week on Back to Our Roots, we're going to be packaging the onion that we had already harvested. We're gonna take you on a trip down Pepper Road and this one right here is finishing up the coop. <laughs> so come on back. Used to the city, now we got our own land. Life's getting real busy, busy. None of it was ever planned. Plan. Got the crib looking pretty, pretty. With a garden full of plants, plans. And we built our own committee. Yeah. From the bottom we advance. Yeah. Back to our roots. roots. Now we get back to our roots. Yeah. Put on your boots. Put on. It's time to go take off your suit. So. Back to our roots. Yeah. yeah. Now we get back to our roots. Yeah. Put on your boots. It's time to farm with Cheryl Swoops right now. Right now. Yeah. Yeah. Right now, right now. All right, guys. So right now we're in the herb garden. Um, just wanted to show you the peppers we have here. We are getting ready to move them over to the big garden to uh, Pepper Row. But um, let's see what we have here. These are some tam jalapenos. Um, I think these are. What are these? Yeah, I don't know. It's so many peppers. I can't remember. Those are the Craig Grande. They're supposed to be a little bigger. Okay. The peppers are supposed to get a little bigger. The Craig Grande. Jala These are Craig Grande jalapenos as well. Mm -hmm. We got some lemon spice jalapenos right here. No, they're not jalapenos, but they're just lemon spice peppers. That's what it's like. Is that it? Yes. <laughs> or some lemon spice something. Yeah, olapeno. Oh, olapeno. So, yeah. I'm sorry, y'all. I yeah. just saw the pino. <laughs> you got those for turf. Um, and then the other one are, I think, tam jalapeno and cayenne pepper. Yeah. And then this is the hottest one. This is uh, this oh, is, this is the Trinidad scorpion. Trinidad scorpion. Well, with a name like that, it's bound <laughs> to do something to you. So I'm gonna move these out soon into pepper row. Um, but these are all the hot peppers. So these are the ones with all the, the heat on them. And as you can see, the Vicks plant is doing really well. <laughs> all right, guys, let's go to the, the big garden. All right, y'all, before we um, go to Pepper Row, wanted to <laughs> show you some of the cucumbers. Yeah, we hadn't been out here in a few days, and they yeah, got out of control. Have, I've been a little under the weather, y'all, so... Look at that. They're Look like a this. melon. <laughs> That's a big that cucumber. That is a big old cucumber. <laughs> this one too. And this one. It's huge. We have already made some pickles. Yeah, we have a lot of them in there. <laughs> There's another big one, I see. Mm -hmm. Okay. What is she barking at? I know that's her because she got a little bitty bark. I think she sees some deer over there. Oh. Out there, she's barking that way. Where? Where? She's barking that way. You want that one too? Yeah. I tried to get it. It's on there pretty good. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. I can't uh -uh. see. There? Yeah. I'm going to leave it. You put it in there. <laughs> All right. Here. <laughs> Sorry, I got it. I can see. It's a nice size one, too. Cool. Uh, pickles are doing good. We have some more coming in, but they've been growing. They really are growing. Well. It was, oh, um, right here, look. It was, it look was a good idea for you to move the trellis over here. Look at this oh. one. Wow. Because last year, wasn't it last year you said they didn't do as good over in the sun? Yeah, they were on the other side. And, um, because we're not like in a here this one too we're not like in a neighborhood or anything so there's no houses or anything to block heat so everything out here you're getting you're getting a whole hundred percent of it in the last few days it's been well over 100 degrees so um they're look good. at that one yeah. they're huge so there's another one look at that And of course, the peaches. So. Y'all, we got so many peaches. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna get some of these off, guys. We're not gonna hold y'all up here to watch all these, but 
we're gonna get some more of these cucumbers off and get off some of these dead leaves and we'll be back welcome to pepper row now you can stand or take a seat but we want you guys to be real careful about what peppers you eat some of the peppers are sweet and some a little tart and some pack heat they hit a million on the scoville chart welcome to pepper row all right back on pepper row and here are our lesias these are pretty. Yeah. They kind of look like bell pepper. Yeah. Right? Yeah, Ain't Linda grew those last year. Are they sweet? Yeah, she said that they're really good. So it's it, pretty. It, was it four of them on there? I'm going to make me a nice little sauce. Oh, five. One, two, three, four. And there's a little one over here coming in. One there. One. One there. So, yeah. It's about five. And then over here, this one has... A few two on it. One there. One there. So, mm -hmm. the Lesias are doing really good, guys. And these? Those are... I don't know, but let me see. These are that one. Advarsky pepper. Yeah, I've never grown these. Advarsky, I don't know. <laughs> They're Baker Creek, but we'll see. Yep, there's some on there, too. There's one. That's a nice one right here. Yeah. And then, it's yeah. pretty. Got a lot of them on there. These are the same? Yep. Yeah. Look, Look at that one right one. there. Mm -hmm. So, well, these turn color. Yeah, they're supposed to be red. So, they're really, really nice. Okay. Really doing good. And it's still coming. Sorry, it's, it's, I was gonna take it out, but it's still. Can you see? Oh uh, yeah, the patty pan. Yeah, these are still hanging in there, guys. The other ones, not so much. But you know what? I'm leaving those because the vine borer is in there. So as long as they're in there and eating, maybe they'll leave these alone. I might be wrong, but well, they look good. They're still hanging in Except there. For that thing right, and these are the. <laughs> Candy cane, I think. Yeah, the sweet, the sweet candy cane peppers. Yeah, these are from turf, and these are ready, guys. So, to give you the, these are pretty. How they look? This is how they start off. They're like green and white, you know, like a candy cane, and then they go to this. They go through this phase where you can still see the white and the green in them, kind of mixed in. Uh, if that makes sense. And then at the end. So I shouldn't have cut that? Yeah, those are ready. Okay. Yeah. So that's like that. Is. Yeah. Beautiful. If I didn't know any better, I would think it was um, something sweet. It, it is a, sweet. Not a pepper, though. Yeah. <laughs> mm. There's another one. Those are so pretty. Well, those are ready to harvest. And we're growing a lot more peppers this year, guys, because we want to eventually find a seasoning that we can create ourselves. What we what we've been reading as far as the in the news with all the, the lead and stuff in the seasoning. In the seasoning, it's not good. That's a good one too. It's been a little windy out here, so I gotta come right and stand these up. But this one's loaded with peppers too. But like I say, when they first start turning, you can see they start to turn red. They still have the green and white uh stripe on them. But they're doing good. And the leaves of course have the the white. These are Shishito. Oh, these are shishito. Shishito. Maybe say that right. <laughs> use a bad word, but yeah, those are those are good. Wouldn't be the first time. <laughs> well. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. These are the Pippin Golden Honey, and um, these are some beautiful peppers. Uh, um, as you can see, they well they start off green, of course, and then they turn purple, and then after they turn purple. Here's the color. So is this the final color? Yeah, those are ready. Those are ready to harvest. And are these the, the orange ones are even sweet? better? Oh, the dark, dark orange. Yeah. Are these um? These are sweet too. Sweet. Yeah, all the peppers out here are sweet. The the hot ones we're gonna bring out a little later. All right. 
So you got a lot. But we'll get these harvested guys and we'll be right back. We Cheryl just took a bite and I took a bite. Those Pippin Golden Honeys are, are really, really good. These are really sweet. Yes. Even the, um, like even eating the seeds out of it. Yes. That's a sweet pepper. I mean, it, it, really it's good. almost like a fruit, fruit really taste. Good. Yeah, wow. So. That's really good, y'all. Yeah, the Pippin Golden Honey are really, mm -hmm. really good. Turf, appreciate you, brother. Mm -hmm. I'm going to save some of these seeds for sure. Oh, man. Yeah, that's a good wow. taste. That's really good. Yep. That's what we got so far, guys. We're going to get these Pippin Golds off, and we'll be right back. All right. We're going to continue on Pepper Row across the street right here. It's Pepper Row Catrines. <laughs> and um, these are more peppers. These are chocolate sweet peppers, I think. Yep. I think you're right. And it's one down there at the bottom. Mm -hmm. Some sweet you chocolate. See you see it right there? This? Oh, uh -oh. over here. It's already chocolate, I think. Oh. I yeah. So when it turns chocolate, it's ready? It's ready. Well, chocolate sweet. It we, definitely is chocolate. <laughs> we also I got that it was from purple uh, at first. Sorry. We also got that from turf. So most of these plants in Pepper Road, the sweet ones, wow. we got from turf and uh, look at that flip side. It is definitely chocolate. Yeah, we have more coming in. So a ton of them on that one. So those are doing really good. Um, these are these are some Texas Toronto's or something. Yeah. I don't know. Texas or Aurora or something. I have no idea. Yeah, I forgot the name of it. Let's see. That was the best I could do. <laughs> I, I, I was writing it from something you had written on. Already. Oh, well, then you probably, you know. <laughs> no, I so that's all right. I could see. My so I don't right. know what those are called. Texas. Yeah, something. but they Texas some. They Baker Creek. And we have a ton of them on there also, but they're not ready. Um, this one, that's the leaves. This one? Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is, let me see. It has leaves like a hot pepper. That's a AJ1. Oh, that's. Ch -ch 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 I have no idea. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's a red pepper from Baker Creek also, so. It's all good. And what is that next one? This one? Yeah, it got peppers on it. Too. Yeah, it has peppers. It is. I don't know. It's it right is here. A... It's right here in the back. Oh, yeah. This is Sugar Rush Peach. Okay, Sugar Rush Peach. Well, they're green right now. It's, it's a few of them on there, but they're, they're like a lime. Lime green. As you can see, there goes one that's peach. You see it? Oh yeah, I see the bottom of it. Yeah. Is it ready? I don't know. Let's try and see. Okay. But it, look, it looks peach. It does look peach. <laughs> but both of those are full. If that's the name, if the if the name if the color reflects the name, that's then it. it's ready. Yeah. Or if the name reflects the color, I don't know which way to put that, but. See. It kind of smells peachy. <laughs> Want me to take a bite? Yeah. What if it's hot? It, it, it kind of tastes peachy too. I mean, smells peachy. Looks good. All of them are sweet. Mm -mm. It's not ready. More hot. It's hot. Good. Oh no! Oh my God! <laughs> oh, that's hot. that's hot. Oh Ooh. wow! Well, it's good, but it's hot. Oh. Well, she bit it. <laughs> <laughs> I took a good bite, y'all. <laughs> How about you take a bite? No, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take your word. I'm gonna take your word. I Ooh. trust you, baby. I trust you. Wow! <laughs> Y'all see how you do me? <laughs> All right, guys. So that's pretty much Pepper Row. 
we have the other ones over there um, and we'll be moving them over here we'll be taking these buckets out and exchanging them with the hot peppers but these are rolling really good now we also want to show you guys our here our uh, tomatoes so I'm taking these are a doing water good break, <laughs> she's taking a t uh, water break on them i'm gonna try we're gonna try one of these yeah, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try, babe. <laughs> These are the black strawberry tomatoes. We're gonna get them off. Um, that's how they start off looking, and this is how they are now. So we're gonna get these off. We have about maybe about ten of them on here. No, one, two, three, four. Yeah, maybe about ten total. So we'll get these off and then we'll be right back and we'll go over and check on the black cream. All right, my wife's back. I'm gonna try one of these um, black strawberry tomatoes. We're not real big tomato eaters, but I picked these because they're supposed to be um, really sweet. So I'm gonna give it a try. It's not bad. I mean, it tastes like a tomato. It is a little sweeter than a regular tomato, though. But it's a tomato. It got like, like a cherry in it a little bit. Well, at yeah. least it wasn't hot. <laughs> Guys, I ain't gonna never live down with that. Hey, baby, it's sweet. Baby, all <laughs> the peppers over here are sweet. Y'all are my witnesses, because y'all heard it too. I'm gonna blame that one on turf. <laughs> yeah, turf, wait till you come back. This side. <laughs> All right, guys, we're going to go over here. First of all, I just wanted to show y'all the, the bab garden, how we've been just taking the dead leaves and putting them down on the soil. I still water it and keep it in. Some of it, grass seeds get in and it grow. I let the grass stay on it just to protect the, the soil. But uh, it's ready for fall. And now we are at the last one, the black crim. I... Uh, Sent a picture of this earlier to Auntie and she said get it off. So I gotta get it, it's starting to split. So uh, yeah. we need to get it. <laughs> <laughs> and as you can see, we have a ton of them on here. It's kind of leaning, I gotta come out here. Put it, the wind was blowing a lot earlier. But uh, yeah, that's it's, a nice big one right there. It's full, yeah. That was the first one that it made, but she said get it off. It's also starting to turn colors. So we just take it off and let it finish in the house. Uh, yeah, it's definitely splitting. Yeah, splitting. So we'll let it finish in the house. I wanted to it grow these, one of these because I saw her grow them last year and they are beautiful. So uh, they turn real black. So, and there's the other one we have over there. The, this tomato is going to turn real black? Uh huh. And that's why it's, it's ready? Yeah, so just let it finish in the house. It'll finish uh, turning colors in the oh, house. Wow. And, and this is our uh, Jamaican sorrel. So it's doing really well. We have two of them out here in the lab. But they're doing good, guys. So that is it. We out here still, guys. It's a little dark. We finished up. We got the top on we're gonna one we're gonna run uh two more boards long ways across and she's ready to frame up so we are just about done on the run and then we can um go ahead and start on the nesting boxes and get the chickens moved out so hopefully we'll get this done in the next few days but just want to let y'all see how we're coming along out here it's the end of the day it's kind of dark out here i don't know how how well y'all gonna be able to see that but all we have for you this week um just wanted to end up over here and let you guys see um the babies let me see there ain't babies yeah, no. here. <laughs> come here look look 
Yeah, these are some cucumbers from uh, from the garden. <laughs> here. This is why they got to get out because it's too crowded in here. Yeah, me and Earl are going to go in and knock this thing out in the next couple days. So next time y'all see these guys, they'll be out in the coop. Hold it and see if they'll come. Here. Come in. <laughs> Did y'all, you want me to get them all of them? Yeah, just dump them. Some of them are bullies in here, y'all. Mm -hmm. They don't like to share. Hopefully, we'll get at least one rooster. I ordered all girls, but maybe all hens, but maybe we'll get one rooster. That's it? Yeah. That's all of the cucumbers. Mm -hmm. So, anyway, guys, that is all we got for you this week. Hope everyone has an incredible, amazing, blessed week. And like always, y'all know how much we love the support. Um, we feel it. It goes right back at you. So, like always, everybody, please stay safe, stay blessed, and stay healthy. We'll see you next time on Back to Our Roots Homestead. See you on the other side, guys. Back to our roots, back to our roots. Back to our roots, back to our roots.